and college central placement service for student placement and this has borne already a lot of fruit to us. We also can envisage increased enrollment of students both for the long and the short courses and of course we continue to enhance the management of the Masaika Forest Block which is within the training arm of the Kenya Forest College. However, Chief Guest as management of the Kenya Forest Service Together with the principal and the leadership of this college, we do acknowledge there are some few challenges and which the service is keen to address. Among them is the low intake and student dropout due to lack of school fees. A student does not benefit from health loan like other higher earning institutions, and this is something that we are putting measures to deal with. The need to upgrade 
and enhance the college facility and infrastructure, and more so, enhance the sporting and the uh, extracurricular activities within the college. Funding and budgetary constraint against uh, escalating commodity prices, and we are planning to put in various resource or, uh, resource or level generation interventions. And of course, we have an issue of water, which we are dealing with. As a service, we shall strive to continuously provide the resources required to support the college to achieve its assigned mandate. However, in a good note, there exist some opportunities which, if effectively exploited, can help in addressing some of the challenges being experienced. And one of the opportunities is actually the placement of new students by the Kenya University and College uh, Central Placement Service. We also have some of our development partner projects side about Kenya shillings 40 million to support capacity building and serve uh, and, and the, the issue of the support of 40 million Kenya students towards so many training functions of the college. And this will provide income generating opportunities for the college. Partnership with the county government and other stakeholders in capacity building in forestry related discipline and implementation of the business plan of the Kenya Forest College. And also we are happy there is a bilateral project between the Kenyan government and the French government uh, to support forest fire management projects and some of the capacity will be building will be done in this college. I therefore take this opportunity to encourage continuing students to work hard, noting that the forest health sector is expanding and employment opportunities will therefore be available going into the future, both within the mainstream public sector, the private sector, but also we want to generate people who can start their own businesses. On its part, chief guest, the service has made it a policy to ensure that we prioritize the graduates from this college, both the certificate and the diploma, in the enrollment of the forester trainee and, and the forester trainee into the service. This year, through a competitive process, we already have advertised about 166 positions. 106 of them is targeting the certificate graduates to be able to serve in the Kenya Forest Service as the nursery head men and women across the country. And that already is a process which is ongoing. At the same space, we also have advertised 30 positions for the diploma holders to become forest trainees within our Kenya Forest Service. And as you know, as we speak today, we have a cohort of diploma holders, about for seven of them, who we hired last year, but one, they have gone into the field and now they are in our Forest Pro Academy undergoing a parametrally training. Again, they were all based on the catchment of the graduates coming from this college. Further, the service through the Council of Governors, we are working together to challenge them and encourage them to also recruit foresters from the Kenya Forest College to serve as county foresters to implement the country forest, pro country forest program, e.g., the county government of Taita Taveta, Embu, Kuale, Nyandarwa have employed some graduates from Rondiani. Chief guests, through the Adopt a Forest Initiative, I would say, as a chief conservator of forest, I have been a silent advocate to partners challenging them to consider graduates from this college, and that has bore some fruits. And I'm happy to report that some of the non stick actors, like the Adlang Restoration Project and Eden Restoration Project and the Danikimadi Foundation, have been able to provide employment to some of the graduates from the college. Forest industry investors, for instance, Komaza, so many which actually I was able to appreciate in Yandaro the other day, have also taken on board some graduates from this college and they have promised to continue in the space for engaging others. The service is currently undertaking private tree nursery registration and certification together with the Kenya Forest Research Institute 
to ensure production of quality and healthy tree seedlings to support the restoration of forest landscapes and woodland enterprises. Hence, the need for qualified nursery practitioners whose catchment can only be from this premier college, the Kenya Forest College, on the end. Other opportunities include small medium enterprises in the forest sector that one can establish, employ themselves, and at the same time create jobs for others. I take this opportunity, therefore, to congratulate all the graduates and their parents, guardians, for the effort made to attain the success and wishing the graduates well in their future endeavor. Allow me to congratulate Wazazi Wote, Wakutpete Watoto, Vijana, Tua Erimisha, Tunajua Munapitia Mabomangumu Nyumbani, Mumefanya Kila Kitu, Mume Sacrifice, to make sure that these young people become people of substance. When you are a pia you are nyinyi kwa maisha yenu, wakue muangaza kwa mamuma zenu, na pia wajisimamishe kama watu ambao wanawezo kwa kujikimu kimaisha, na kusaidia wale wengine wajikimu. Kwa hivyo wazazi wote, kongera kwenu. Pia ni shikume jukumu la kushukuru sana, kushukuru mungu, kwa sababu wakati tulikuwa na graduation last time, kwa kweli tulikuwa kwa hali ya pandemic, covid na wazazi ya mungu weza kuwa na sisi. Tunashukuru mungu kwa mba hili janga limeendelea kudidimia na diposa na kuraia sisi when, 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 when upika kuweza kuwa na wa, watoto wenu hili tukuraie pamoja kama jamii. Tunashukuru mungu kwa kutupea siyo na fasi. Asante ni sana. I urge graduating students to make good use of the knowledge and skills that you have been able to acquire for the period that you have been here to better yourselves and also for others. To the graduates, this is just for the beginning to seek opportunity to further your knowledge and acquire experience, including voluntary work in forestry and forestry related enterprises that will assist you to network with the forest sector players. Lastly, but not least, just get Allow me to convey my word of gratitude to the principal and the entire Kenya Forest Service uh, College, Kenya Forest College fraternity, for preparing the graduates well for the world of work ahead of you. I want to say, graduates, as we heard from a song sung here, we want to convey our blessings unto you so that any door that you knock will be opened for you. I wish. You all save Janimasis and God blessings. Thank you so much.